Hello and welcome again to Prohibition University in a short little instructional video. What I'm doing right here is making my annual supply of limoncello liquor. Uh, my starting material in this brown jug is some liquor material, 92% uh, made in the hillbilly still. The raw material for making that alcohol was apples. And as you can see in this Brita filter here, I'm simply filtering the uh, liquor through there. I'm going to pass it through twice. It's actually not too bad as it is unfiltered, but uh, I'm just going to improve it a little bit. What I've got is a collection of lemons that I got at the uh, grocery store. Not entirely happy with the lemons we get here in Canada. They uh, tend to be picked uh, off the tree before they're ripe, and then by the time they arrive at the grocery store, uh, in a lot of cases, some of them still have bits of green unripened on them. But I picked out the best ones that I could find and uh, I've cleaned a couple one liter glass jugs and sterilized them and you can see in the bottom of this one jug here I've got some lemon peel so the recipe is very simple to each of these jugs which I will put in uh, 500 mils of alcohol in to 500 mils I'm going to put the peels of four lemons so peels of four lemons in that one peels of four lemons in that one 500 mils of the alcohol in each uh, jug I'm going to put the lids on. Those jugs are going to sit then at room temperature in a dark cupboard, cabinet, pantry, um, somewhere out of the sunlight, and it's going to sit for seven days. That will be enough time for the alcohol to draw the essential oils out of the lemon peel. And at that point in time, I'm going to um, uh, run it through a filter to uh, get rid of the peels obviously and any uh, any other suspended solids and I will simply then take that uh, lemon alcohol mixture and proof it down by the addition of some simple syrup which I will make uh, by adding equal parts water and sugar bringing to a boil on the stovetop and that combination of the lemon alcohol and some simple syrup gives me my limoncello and I can tell you that it is something that I do drink a lot of, especially in the wintertime um, with a bit of dark chocolate. It is absolutely wonderful. So there you have it. Uh, if you can make alcohol at home, uh, and if you have access to lemons at your store, you too can be making limoncello liqueur in the comfort of your own home. Thanks for watching, and have a wonderful day.